This is Morticia, Moody Gardens giant corpse flower. Um, these are very, very rare, not only in the wild, but also in cultivation. Moody Gardens has had this bulb for about five years. This is her second blooming. She bloomed in June of 2012, and we're really excited that she's gonna be blooming here at Moody Gardens again within the next week or two. Well, it's very hard to determine when exactly she will bloom, but she broke dormancy about four weeks ago, and it's typically about anywhere from four to six weeks when they reach full bloom. So she could bloom any time between the next week, probably to 10 days. So at the beginning of this week, she was about 23 inches tall. Since she's been in the rainforest this week, she's grown almost a foot. She's now 32 inches tall. So she's put on quite a bit of growth in the past week here at Moody Gardens. Well, the common name, corpse flower, comes from the fact that when they bloom, they emit a horrible, rotting stench. So I just thought, Morticia, it just kind of popped into my head when I got the bulb. <laughs> It's been described as a cross between rotting fish, uh, some dirty socks. Um, it kind of smells like something dead. <laughs> so there, were, there have only been about 120 quartz flowers that have ever bloomed in the United States since 1937. And our quartz flower here at Moody Gardens is only, this will be the fifth bloom ever recorded in the state of Texas. So it's a very rare opportunity to ever get to see one. So I really encourage you to come out and experience this once in a lifetime event. So Morticia's flower, when it's in full bloom, will consist of a tall spadix and a beautiful deep maroon colored spathe or flower. Um, these are one of the most beautiful flowers in the world. So we're on Quartz Flower Watch as right now and we're expecting her to bloom within the next week. And when she does, the night that she opens is when you'll experience the most powerful stench. Um, last time she bloomed, we could smell it all the way outside of the visitor center. So if you really want to experience the funk, you really need to watch what she's doing and come see her when she blooms.